Intelligent transport systems, more commonly known as ITS, are the key to the future of our society. Here in Stockholm, at the ITS World Congress, the Volvo Group is showcasing examples of its latest ITS-related technology. Every year, about 40,000 people die and millions are injured on Europe's roads. Road accidents also cost society around 160 million euros per year. That's why road safety is a high priority for the EU and for the Volvo Group. Here at the ITS World Congress, we are demonstrating the result of the European Union collaboration project CVIS and SafeSpot. Uh, they are based on vehicle-to-vehicle -vehicle and vehicle-to-infrastructure communication, and we call that uh, cooperative systems. Uh, we are probably demonstrating the most advanced system we've ever done before. Uh, we're using all the sensors in the vehicle, and we connect the, the different vehicles with each other. So we're using the sensors of other vehicles to improve safety and efficiency. The Volvo trucks demonstrate how frontal and rear-end collisions can be avoided, thanks to cooperative systems which enable the vehicles to communicate with each other warning each other of potential hazards. For example, parked cars and pedestrians crossing the street. Besides improving safety, ITS solutions can also increase traffic efficiency and effectiveness, thus delivering significant benefits to the environment. There is a really strong connection between ITS and environment. If we want to mitigate and, and reduce carbon dioxide from the transport in society, there are a number of different routes that needs to be taken. And one of the parts in this, in this route is to utilize ITS solutions to improve logistics and to improve transport efficiency, to provide solutions that the customer really see as a strong benefit for, for their business is the first one. Without that, we won't succeed. The second one is also to influence uh, large customers or, and large organizations like cities. In this conference, urbanization have been discussed and green cities. So then they could help in establishing a good market for ITS solutions by putting stringent requirements on the transport solutions that they buy.